the first of our world championship matches of our two world championship matches starts next a list who lost the opening match earlier here tonight against Vic Mignogna must fight in this first championship match and if a list has any hopes to want to walk out as the world champion he has to beat Dez here tonight in this match and then go on to have a rematch with Vic Mignogna in the main event and win that match too we have heard choice words backstage from A-List since this decision was made back at the Pro and Celeb Mixtape Tournament. We even have Vic Mignogna having some choice words towards A-List. He wants the world title back. A-List wants to become world champion. Dez wants to retain the world championship. And the collective has their eyes set on me backstage because of this entire craziness. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the Continental Impact Wrestling. My God. You'd have to wonder, you have to sit down and wonder if A list is has any damage retention, has any pain from the earlier match here tonight after going through the hell and back in that match. He has to now win this match if he wants the title and then win another match if he wants to retain the championship. This could be A-list night. He could become the new world champion. But how much pain is he in from his Vic Mignogna match earlier here tonight? My God, Dez, Dez is pissed right now that he has to go through this challenge. You do not understand. Recently, I had to deal with him in my office. I had to deal with Jason in my office. I had to deal with Rico Suave in my office. I had to deal with A-List in my office, Fit Mignogna in my office. The whole collective is a three-on-one in my office. About the decision I made to do this, and I'm doing it out of fairness for both Vic Mignogna and A-List, and they both are after me for this, especially A-List, and then the collective is on my ass because of me doing this, thinking I'm trying to screw them over and screw out the world champion and screw over Dez, and I'm saying, I'm just doing this because they both issued the thing. They were both given the chance. Winning that tournament means both of them get a chance at any match they want. And it's not out of the freaking rules that Vic could ask for a world championship match. And I'm not going to give them a triple threat because they both earned their own title matches. And they're both going to happen here tonight. And then instead of doing the stupid flipping of a coin like WB's done, I'm doing this. Is it unfair? Maybe. Is who I care? No. But it's, it is literally evil intent. There's evil intent on if you want to become world champion, you have to go through the pain here tonight. And I can't believe freaking Bez is being a crybaby about it when he had to go through the three stages of Satan challenge from Damien Darkado back in season one at Sunset Showdown. He's went through an insane amount of challenges, and since starting the collective, he's become a crybaby backstage. God, folks, this, the house is going to blow off the BOK, BOK Center. 
The fans are on their feet. The first of two world title matches here tonight. Fans want to see Dez lose it. Fans want to see Vic Mignogna win it. Fans want to see A-List win it. They hate seeing these two guys fight. But there's been some... <laughs> and we got in a clothesline a fresh Dez versus a not-so-fresh... I mean, he had two matches to rest, but that's not enough to get the rest here. <laughs> a takedown. in a clothesline from and they're fighting he's fighting in desperation mode he's fighting furious he's fighting angrily and that's what cost him this match earlier tonight against Vic Mignogna a match he easily could have won but everything's riding on his mind the whole chaos championship situation in a reversal Head strike from the challenger. A takedown from Dez to the challenger. Taking it any which way. And a one count. And he broke out of the pin. A list getting some distance between him. And he's, and he's and he's taunting him running across the ropes there he's telling him to get back in the ring and a strike two and Dez is down for a face buster from the challenger and if if Alist wants to walk out the champion here tonight. He better hope that he can win this match quickly enough so he has enough energy for Vic Mignogna later on tonight. And a running, punching strike. Takedown to Dez. The fans here booing. They've been wanting to see Dez lose the title for a long time. He's fought numerous challengers this season. From Nick Dragoon the Phenom, and because of bullcrap every other time, he has retained that title. He even had to freaking force Chris Pratt. And I've heard rumors even backstage that the Collective have had their hands on Chris Pratt after that match. They got furious at him. They got pissed off at him. A slap across the face. He has the clothesline. Trying to go for a pin as early as possible. One. No. He's getting... You're, you're, you can see the look on Alex's face, on Ava's face. He doesn't know what he needs to do to keep him down. He's trying to get in desperation mode. This is what he worked hard for. This is what he wanted from the Pro and Celeb Tournament. And this is not how he wanted it. One. And there's just reversal central backstage, back here. Both these men. Whoa to win a strike to the face and a takedown both men in almost desperation mode because they know they have another match if they win this thing and they both want the world championship and he gets right back up and he throws Dez off his turn buckle Oh, he died and he slid. And the fans are on their feet. Any move could desperately win this match. Any move could win this. And he throws him on the ropes. And he's taking down Dez. He's taking down Dez. And a takedown. Outside the ring. You can't win outside the ring. <laughs> he knows that.
and he throws him almost across the freaking barricade there. And he has him up top. Oh, that face first. Weakening him. Weakening him. And he's trying to signal for the end here. And there's a count out. He will move on if he counts him out. Damn it, Dez. Don't go this way. And he's getting back in the ring. He's hoping for him to be counted out. But a list. And he's... Oh, God. And a clothesline. And he gets another drop. Ick. He's kicking us down. He's frustrated. He's frustrated as hell. He wanted this title shot. This is not how he wanted it. And he's just kicking the ever loving hell out of Dennis. And that could cost him in the end. And he caught him with the Fez press. And he gets right back up. He has him up for a stunner, for a stunner, for a STUNNER! And a kick out, God! The heart and determination of A-list, he does not want to lose this. He's showing off. He is showing off. Drops. The freaking knee on him. A kick. He's. He's just take. Oh god, he slid. He slid. And a take down to the champion and a list. Does not care anymore. He's going up top for a Daniela! He's going up top. He's going up top. He's telling him. And Dez is getting up. Dez is getting up. He's got his eyes set on Tez. Drop kick. Drops him using the turnbuckle for extra leverage. Drops with a jawbreaker. One, two, and Alex. Alex kicks out of it. He's telling him. And a kick, a backhanded kick. The clothesline from. And he caught him. Wait, no. Wait, no! I thought he had him there, but Dez reversed it and slammed him to the mat. He's here on the ropes. And Dez in desperation mode now, too, because he knows if he wins this match, he has to fight Vic Mignogna in the main event. And these men are, like, any move can end this match. Any move could take down their opponent. Any move could finish them off. And a Thez press. He's going up top. No. Alex. No. One, two, three. And Tez goes on to face Vic Mignogna later on tonight. My God. 
A-list fought hard. He may have lost against McMahon earlier tonight, but he almost won this match on several occasions and just barely was winded more so than Dez to go on. And the Frog Splash wins Here's the match. The And the referee, he got him, Dez. He threw the referee out of the ring as he's celebrating still the CKW World Champion. But will that remain later on tonight when he has to retain the title also in another match against Vic Vignana? God damn blood dripping from his face. He got cut open during that match, but he still won it.